Hello and welcome back to Top Troops, everybody. And today we are going to dive into a quick Chambers of Destiny, Tier 8, Floor 3. As you can see, I've already cleared this, but this is kind of what I can clear relatively with a bit of ease. Mostly, I think I'm leaning towards uh, attack um, for most of them, and after that, I think it would be most likely something like attack speed and possibly defense. So let's go for this one. Move speed is not really something that I would be looking at. I don't know how big that impact. <laughs> Let's go for Spirit Tiger, and obviously our route is straight through the middle to get max amount of mercenaries. spawns a few extra units which can distract the enemy. Uh, obviously the angel. There we go. Something like this covers off three of the great stuff. me why I get all of these different types of units from the crates and also from here. I believe that when you complete a node the unit that you get is the level that you have them at currently. Um, and then the ones you get from the boxes is some sort of average. I'm not exactly sure how that's working out because it's different for people um, but I think it's the average of the top eight units that you have. If somebody knows please do say in the comments. Okay, now positioning is starting to matter slightly, and I know I'm bad at this, and I thank the people that are commenting and guiding me. I apologize, I'll try and get better. Um, I just find the healing, actually the shield provided does good things and here obviously this is best, we have a bunch of melee fighters um, so it does really benefit us. This one, um, let's see, 
Yeah, I'm gonna take that. So enemies can no longer crit, so no massive damage. This. Yes, there is a line connecting it. Uh, I definitely do want the extra units. You can go to the front of it. damage always yes
Something like this. Something like that. <laughs> there because I'm a little army here. Um, This is still pretty good. Let's see, where do we want you guys to land? Uh, there, and there, and there, please. Let's see what happens. I can serve as a distraction. Um, 
I rarely go for these unit rank upgrades. I don't really like them. I prefer Blessing, but the entire squad. Um, okay, now, what do we want to kill? If we do this and this, and you go there, I think this is a big part of it. So, for those of you that don't know, Bandolero scales off of his um, allied units that have fallen in battle, so you want to take him out as soon as you can. That epic looks like it's the best, has some additional damage. I do think that these do stack. Don't know why, but hopefully I'm right. Um, let's see here. Engineer, we've survived. She's one of my favorite units just because I have her on a decent level uh, on my primary. Okay, now. You go there, you go there, and you. Try and kill that, you do that. This is going to be tough with all of these bandoleros, and you guys are going to see why in a second. But if I don't take these archers out of there. so that each one of them can trigger a stun is really helpful. Uh, so 
So let's see now. I need these to disappear quite fast. Um, along as it is. This round has gone way better than I expected. And with that, without even refreshing my lives. And it is attack speed, unfortunately. But we'll find it at some point or another. Um, and with that, my storage is full again. That's why I've been just leaving these squad points that come from the, the particles. Um, but yeah, with that, please go to the comments and do tell me what tier and floor you're on and if you do just find a comment or a question that you have an answer to please feel free to comment and help out fellow players have a great day and see you guys soon cheers